Hi guys, and welcome to today's video. Now this is my December favourites, but it's my non-beauty favourites for you guys to show you what I've been absolutely loving throughout December. So without further ado, I'm going to crack on, otherwise I'll just keep blabbing away like I normally do. So let's start off with something, oh my god, super yummy, which I'm so excited about eating, and I'm actually really surprised I have not eaten this already. So you guys, you are lucky this is not half munched. So this is... Oh, it's my name, my chocolatey name, and it's all glittery and sparkly and perfect. Now, this is by a company called Coco Maya or Coco Maya, something like that, and they basically do all sorts of different chocolates, and you can personalise them, put the name on, and super glittery and lovely. So, if you've got any birthdays or Valentine's Day coming up, that sort of thing, look at how pretty it is. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to eat it. I'm really hoping. I mean, obviously, this glitter will be edible, but imagine if it wasn't. That'd be really awkward. I'd just be like munching on glitter but I'm so so excited to um, try this because it's been looking so perfect and lovely for ages and it's taken all the willpower in the world not to eat it so yes loving that sticking with the glittery theme there's another couple of things I love a bit of glitter at this time of year who doesn't so this is an amazing nail file and this is by feel unique and it's still in its little packaging so I like to be a bit OCD with things like this but I absolutely love it because it's so obviously good because it's got um, uh, the, obviously the filing board sort of on the other side but then it's also got this really pretty glitter sort of um, silver glitter on the top and I love anything sparkly anything that's going to make your nails look super pretty and that's I'm just obsessed with at the moment got to be looking nice haven't you girls got to be looking nice so glitter goes a long way and then finally my glitter thing my last glitter thing is this bag by alphabet bags I am obsessed this has obviously the letter H on the front for Holly or hello but it's for Holly so um it's a, a gold sort of makeup bag and well it's black obviously but it's got a gold H on it that's what I meant and then it's got quite a lot of space in there so I'm going to put some sort of everyday essential makeup in there or like brushes or that sort of thing so I'm super excited to sort of um, I've been trying to keep it really nice for you guys to not use it that much but um, I can imagine me absolutely trashing it <laughs> but it's nice because it's black as well and it's quite durable so that's going to take a lot of pounding from me because I literally kind of that sounds really wrong but you know what I mean <laughs> awkward um you know what I mean like I'm just going to move on, it's very durable, we'll leave it at that. So next, let's go, this is all going to go horrifically wrong today. So, okay, next I have, in fact I'm going to leave that until last because you're going to absolutely love that to pieces. So, um, next let's do a hair bow. You guys know from before I've talked about hair bows, I'm obsessed with them, they just look super pretty in your hair, obviously you wouldn't put them anywhere else, um, but look at this! So you could fake it actually and you could wear it as a bow tie or on your head if you want to look really cool or like Minnie Mouse. Anyway, I'm going to stop that. But you can put it anywhere and it's just on a little clip. So you could tie up your hair, that sort of thing, and then like clip it in. Or you could just have like pin it up at the back and then just have it sort of on the back of your head looking beautiful. And this is kind of like a real tartan sort of, almost like Scottish sort of theme. Loving it. So it's like got blues and um, kind of greens and reds in there. Loving life and I am obsessed. I'm going to be wearing this a lot over the the next few months so that's great and even into the summer as well I think you can still get away with it love a bit of a hair bow okay then moving on to a good old necklace who doesn't love a necklace well I bloody well do so this is by um, Accessorize and it's just on like a gold chain I'm trying to put it against me so you guys can see but it's just on a gold chain it's got like um sort of I mean they're a bit weird they're kind of like diamondy sort of shapes and then I don't know, you've just got a few jewels kind of thrown in there and it just looks so pretty, just against anything, even like this at the moment, how cool would that be? So loving that, I love a good statement sort of necklace, but this isn't too over the top, it's quite nice and reserved, so I love that a lot. Okay, then, second to last, oh my gosh, I've been obsessed with these since I bought them, I think I've worn them a lot, like way too much, people are literally like, do you not have another pair? Anyway... These are from Zara, and look at these, da, 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 these cheeky little numbers. These are like some, just some black shorts. Now you might think, oh, that's really boring, but down this side, oh, hello detailing. It's kind of like sequins and beading. Um, I wouldn't say sequins, that was a complete lie, sorry. Uh, I mean, it's just beading, and it's so pretty down the side, and just kind of jazzes it up a little bit, so I look like, you know, 
some crazy jazzy person walking down the street and I am obsessed with those so I've kind of put it with like a nice sort of floaty top or something like that it's something almost like what I'm wearing now just a little bit crazy and then it kind of nips it in at the at the waist and just looks beautiful with some black tights and heels perf love that and then the final thing oh my gosh I'm so excited that I nearly revealed to you earlier but decided not to okay I haven't actually opened this so I'm praying it actually works but I'm so so excited so let me just really quickly give you some background okay on this bit random you will remember this if you were probably like a 90s kid I would have thought or in fact maybe even sooner than that anyway it's a bit retro but I love it so me and my sister basically were in London the other day having a bit of a discussion because she wants a dog and I'm like no you can't look after a dog that's ridiculous we're too busy anyway she was then like okay um I really want one blah 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 keep going on so I was just like oh so I said okay I would make a compromise with you if you can keep a Tamagotchi so one of these like computer pets alive for six months no I said a year actually but she then got me down to six months um then we will renegotiate so you know don't tell her that but she's probably still not going to get one but anyway um if she could look after one of these ah so excited this is so retro this is amazing so then she can supposedly have a dog but this is basically 49 pets in one oh my god you don't ever need a pet again just have one of these bad boys and you can pick from like a robot an alien i don't really understand how that's a pet or a vampire but anyway um like bat bunny hamster cat dog fish whatever i'm gonna go for like the craziest thing ever and we're basically gonna have a competition of who is going to be able to keep theirs alive for the longest because they were actually pretty hard to keep alive back in the day when I used to have one of these I think it's because I used to like, leave them so they're on a little key ring I'll be able to carry it around with me so I think you guys should name my pet for me what would you like me to have what kind of crazy animal and what should their name be boy or girl up to you guys I will decide um obviously it's a pink one because I'm love my pink um but i'll keep you guys updated with like twitter and uh instagram and all that crazy jazz which i know it sounds really exciting to see how my tamagotchi is doing but um, i'm really excited about this we went into hamley's in london 32 pounds i was like are you joking so this was a fiver on amazon if you guys want to get involved get one as well so excited i'll link it below so anyway those are my non-beauty favourites for the month of December. As you can tell, I'm far too excited about the Tamagotchi. Um, but I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope you had a lovely, lovely festive period. Or whatever you were doing, I hope you had a great time. And please give this video a massive thumbs up for me. And of course, remember to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done already. Why the hell not? Then I will see you guys in a few days' time in my next video. Bye! You can see how much I love it, because look at my cushions, they're all this kind of colour, so that's amazing. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just love this, um, how it goes on, because it doesn't streak, it doesn't get those annoying, like, brush.